Hey, what's up, y'all? If you're clicking this video, it's because you're trying to get the Elder Jotunheart and you either don't know how to do it or have some doubts. So, yeah, let's get down to business. So, how does it work? To be able to find the Elder Jotun uh, tree, you have to go to the Hunter Forest biome. You can see on your screen right now, Hunter Forest. It's for level 70, so you need to be at that gear score to make it easier for you. So, if you don't know how to unlock the Hunter Forest, you will have to go to your main uh, realm in your base, and you will find there uh, a point of interest that is for you to get the Hunter card. If you don't have that quest yet on uh, your right, on your, your quest list, it's because you're not there yet. So just keep following the quests and you will get uh, to the, the point where you will be able to get the Hunter card. All right, once you did that, you have to create the Hunter card and the Forest card. And let's start here. So we are right here in the realm already. And there are mainly two ways you can find the Elden Jotun tree. The first of them is just walk around and hope you find it. Uh, when you're close to it, uh, a boss bar will appear. Can you stop there, Lucy, please? And the second way is the easiest way. Uh, you have to get a specific uh, enchantment. And that enchantment is called Track Legend. So for you to unlock the Track Legend, you have to go to the Desert Provisioner Biome. And there you'll be able to buy it from the Essence Trader. So normally there are two essence traders in the realm. If it's not in one of them, it's in the other. They don't normally sell the same stuff. So if you go there, you will find and you'll be able to buy the uh, Trek Legend enchantment. Then you will just craft it and put in your weapon. In this case, they put on my pickaxe. Uh, now I will use it. And this will take me to the Elder Jotun tree. So just, let's just follow it. And you will see, it will take us straight there. So you just need to follow the spark of light. And once you're there, there are two ways you can obtain the Elden Yotun Heart. There's the easy way. I think it's the easy way, which is killing the tree. And then you have the hard way. For the hard way, it's a lot of work. Uh, you will need to unlock some stuff. You have to do a new mission. Because you will need to unlock a specific recipe. So far, uh, the, only, the only thing I heard you can give as a reward is the rit ritual fabled meat. And for that, you have to follow a different quest line. I will make another video about that one. How to get the recipe and how to craft uh, this food because it's just uh, so long it needs uh, a different video on its own. But the way I did it, I killed the tree. And you can see here, the Elder Jotun tree is here. Pretty easy to find once you get the enchantment. It will save you a lot of time. You won't have to run around trying to find it. And yeah. So I will just try to kill it so you can see the move set. So you are prepared if you decide to fight it. And if you don't want to fight it and you want to give the reward. Uh, you will see that there is somewhere uh, an offering altar. Let's see if we can find it somewhere. Oh yeah, it's right here. So you can see here, offering altar. You will click here and you will give something. Uh, if it's not 
the thing they wanted. Like, they want a ritual fabled meat. I will put just a fabled meat to see if it works. And it did not work. You can see that Elden Yotten Tree gave me, gave me a wood bundle. And he won't attack me or anything. Now, if I attack the tree, then we'll have some problems. So you should focus the weak points, which are under their legs, let's say. So right there. No, that wasn't right. If you try to shoot on the back legs, it's easier to get to the point. Let's see. Yeah, it's not that easy to hit the weak point. If you are using the pistol, it's pretty easy to kill it. You just need to dodge. Use your right mouse button. Oh, now we hit 677, so we got the hit point. The, the weak spot. And don't walk through these walls because they hit quite hard. Uh, what happened to her? Did it get stuck or something? Well, I think sh I think the trick just bugged. Lucky for us, I guess. But don't count. This will happen when you try it. Okay, I think it got unstuck now. Okay, that wasn't very good. Don't try that at home. So there are these little berries or whatever those are that they go after you. So just just run from it. Of course, you can also shoot the, the body if you make it, if you think it's easier, but then you won't hit the, the weak spot. Okay, we're almost halfway through. Now there is a bear. Come on, bear. Give me a break. And Lucy is just <laughs> chopping some logs. Okay, that was a good one. Yeah. Yeah, you basically take four times the the normal normal attack when you hit the, the weak spot. Okay, we have to use the shotgun now. Not sure what's happening with the tree right now. Let's try this. Well, is the tree sleeping? to run around it and hit his legs and you should be good don't go over those because you take damage or you can't go through both you take damage and you can't go through them make sure to bring some potions with you they will be helpful 
and this is much easier than uh, getting the potion it's faster than getting the potion if you are at least level 70 you won't have much trouble with this and if you're playing with friends it will be pretty easy Okay, I think one more hit. Okay, we did it. Now we just need to harvest it. Bring your axe. And you get a few uh, hearts. And those will be enough for your friends. I think you have like around six hearts. Let's see, one, two, three, five, six. Seven, eight hearts actually, and you also got some wood from the the Alden Yoden tree. So that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. It was helpful to you. Uh, if it was, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel to support us. And that's it for now. I'll catch you guys in the next video.